Hey Dodge and welcome back. Thanks for joining me again. Today's drawing lesson is good for all ages. Um, and we're gonna go into the ocean and draw an octopus that's kind of coming out of the water a little bit. So it should be pretty cool. Also gonna do some coloring tips at the end again, cause that was fun when we did the butterfly. So let's get into it. All right. So our octopus is gonna be partly out of the water. So we are going to draw his head first. It's gonna be something like this. Okay. Now the water ripples are gonna be around his head right here. going to draw different lines that go around the octopus. We're going to draw a kind of a cool face. His eyes are way down here. Kind of cartoony, but cool. We're going to have some big eyes. But he's a friendly octopus. Now we're going to color this in, but leave a little highlight in the like right there. Okay, then do this one too. Now, octopus usually have like little spots and stuff on them. So we're gonna add some little, just some different size spots around him there. Now here's where it gets cool. We're gonna start putting his tentacles coming out. So we're gonna start with kind of a larger one up front here. It's gonna be up, it's gonna curve around like that, and then come back down. Then we're gonna do the same thing with the water ripples. Go around the tentacle here. Kind of cool, huh? Then we're gonna put maybe a shorter one uh, more on the side here. Kind of like this. Do our water ripples again. Now I'm gonna do a little bit larger one here that gets closer to us. That would be kind of cool. A little bit wider and a little bit bigger. Whoa. He's coming after us. Now, I'm not gonna do all eight. I'm just going to do a few, but you could add more, totally. That would be cool. I'll probably add one more, I think, maybe, maybe up front here. A sh just a small one kind of peeking out like this. You could be creative and, and change it up. All right, there's, there's four of his tentacles. Now, we're gonna add the little suction cups. We wanna keep them on the same edge. It's kind of, <clears throat> facing us, and we're going to do something like this. Okay, so keep that edge that they're kind of facing out on. And this one would be probably more here. I've always liked underwater animals and creatures. I think they're really interesting. <clears throat> All right, cool, cool. Now, I like him. We're gonna do some coloring here. I wanna show you just like I did before. I like to do some with marker and some with pencil. Not all with marker though. I'm gonna kind of do a little bit like light, lights coming from this side. So I'm going to darken the left side of my Mr. Octopus here. You could also outline the whole thing first, but I just like to do an edge. Make this a little bit more there. Okay, now this one, because it curves this way, we're gonna leave this side blank and come all the way around. 
like that. All around like that, okay? Then what I do is I take my pencil and I do a different purple and I like to darken it really close to this edge. Now I'm doing this pretty fast. But you should take your time here. And then I start lightening it up all the way across, just to give it a little bit of a shading, a little bit of light and dark areas. Now I probably won't have time to do all my tentacles on this video. So I'm just gonna do his head for right now. See how it's lighter here and it gets darker, darker color in this edge. This is more like a, almost like a maroon and a purple. Like that. And then I'm gonna do, I wanna do the water. So I'm going to take my blue, do some blue over these water lines. It's good to have contrast, dark and light colors. Makes it a lot more interesting. Then I take my light blue and now I can kind of really start just going around these. You always want to use light and dark in your art. Makes it a lot more interesting. Look at that, that's cool. Just kind of create more ripples. Just have fun with it, sketch around it. So I'm running out of time here, but I would do this to these other tentacles and then also color the little suction cups, right, for this guy. Um, even these spots could be a little different color. Maybe I'll color these spots in because these are part of his skin, not really suckers. I think that looks cool. Oh yeah, that looks cool. Look at that guy. That's pretty cool. Well, that's as far as I can get today to make sure I keep this under eight minutes. But hopefully you like drawing the octopus with me. Um, oh, he's looking at me. Uh, try it out, send me photos, and I'll see you next time. Bye.